components of water supply scheme includes huge costly structure which cannot be increased in their capacity or cannot be replaced easily. For this purpose, components of water supply scheme are made larger by estimating the future population. In this way, expansion of water supply scheme can be avoided by considering the population forecast in the design of water supply scheme. Hence, water supply scheme is not designed for the present population, it is designed for future population. Hello my dear viewers, welcome to Simplified Civil and Geotechnical Engineering channel. I am Akshay Jaiswal. In this video, I am going to explain methods of forecasting of population. Mainly, there are three methods of population forecast. First one is arithmetical increase method, second one is geometrical increase method and third one is incremental increase method. So in this video, I am going to explain first method of population forecast which is arithmetical increase method. Chapter number one sources and quality of water. Solved examples on forecasting of population that is, finding future population. Our first method is arithmetical increase method. First point in this method, the increase in the population per unit time is assumed to be constant. Per unit time means decade is considered here and meaning of one decade is 10 years. Thus, present population is denoted by P0. Next one is average increase. It is denoted by letter small d and then population is denoted by Pn that is population after n decades and by using arithmetical increase method population after n decades is given by the formula Pn is equal to Po plus n into d. Now we will see formula to find n where n is number of decades in which we are going to find out future population. Formula is n is equal to future population minus last known population divided by 10. Future population means the year in which we want to find out the population minus last known population means available data of population of last known decade Example number one, find the population of the town after three decades by arithmetical increase method. Year and population is given. Now by using arithmetical increase method, we will solve this example. Present population is given by PO is equal to 9150. It is present population which is given in this table that is last known population in year 2001 is 9150 then population pn after n decades is given by the formula pn is equal to po plus n into d now we will solve problem according to this formula pn is equal to po plus n into d First, we will find this D and to find the value of this D, we need to use table and we need to find out increase in population and, and then we will find average of last column. Now observe this table carefully. In year 1961, population was 4320. In 1971, population is 5200, means in this 10 year, means in this one decade, 
we need to find out increase in population and to find the increase in population just take difference between these two population values means 5200 minus 4320 we will get the value as 880 so we can say that increase in population from 1961 to 1971 is 880 similarly we need to find out increase in population between 1971 to 1981 here increase in population can be determined by taking difference between these two values that is 7120 minus 5200 we will get difference that is 1920 now we will find increase in population between 1981 to 1991 again we need to take difference between population values of these two years that is 8000 minus 7120 and difference will be 880 so we can say that increase in population in this one decade is 880 and then we will find increase in population it will be 9150 minus 8000 we will get 1150 now we will take average of these four values it will be the value of d for taking average just add 880 1920 880 and 1150 and after adding all these values divide it by 4 as there are four values in this table and total of this four number is 4830 and after dividing by 4 we will get the average that is 1207.5 increase in population per decade d is equal to 1207.5 and approximately we can say 1208 in question it is given that find out population after 3 decades hence value of n will be 3 and our formula is pn is equal to p0 plus n into d now we have to find out value of pn after 3 decades then p0 we have value of p0 that is last known population from this table we have value of n that is 3 decades and value of d it is calculated here that is 1208 by using all these values we can find out pn and that is 9150 plus 3 into 1208 we will get value of pn that is 12774 is the population of town after 3 decades means population of year 2031 is 12774 hope you like the information given in this video if you are watching my channel for first time then click on subscribe and share with all your friends thanks for watching jai hind vande mataram